Hey guys, in today's video, I'm checking out the game Excel. I've been approached to do a sponsored video for this game, but if I'm being honest, I've had my eye on this game since first seeing it during the Guerrilla Collective Showcase this summer. It's an action-adventure RPG like Legend of Zelda if it were sci-fi, and you all know I enjoy both of those aspects very much. This game is being developed by Tiny Roar and published by Assemble Entertainment. In Excel, you play as Reed, who is shipwrecked on a strange land with no memories of her former life. Explore the world, solve challenging puzzles, and imposing dungeons while meeting new friends and foes. Now that sounds a lot like Legend of Zelda, right? Now considering this is my first ever sponsored video I'm doing on YouTube, it would mean a lot to have your support on it. Do a couple things for me here. Leave a like and a comment on the video of course, and second, go check out the game on Steam. I left a link in the description down below and I'll probably leave it as a pinned comment as well that'll take you to the Steam store page for Excel. There is a demo available for you to play right now which is what we're about to play right here in this moment. So with that said, work. let's check this game out. Now, this game does come out on July 12th in full release, and that's less than a month away, so we're not far off. So let's go ahead and check out the demo here. Let's get started. Start a new game. And there's the ship crash landing. excitement down a notch would you <laughs> oh what the and who are you anyway nice to meet you chap my name is wait i am i who am i oh we start without even knowing our name oh no 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 this can't be happening i don't even recall this place Am I in a freaking forest? And what the hell am I doing in a crash spaceship? I'm something like a fancy astronaut. I seem to really suck at it. All right. Breathe. There is an explanation for everything. So we do know our name is Reed by the description of the game, as I read it off to you guys earlier. So, you know, spoilers, I guess. <laughs> but the story of the game is we don't know our own name. We're suffering severe amnesia so, here. after the other. Where the heck are we, little guy? We're at Beep garden? Boop. Whose garden exactly? Cell? Just X-E-L? It doesn't ring a bell, but it seems you know what you're talking about. All right, little buddy. Let's check out this garden and look for that mysterious cell person. Let's hope they have the tools to remove this rock that hurts like hell out of my face. All right. And here we are. So this is a uh, decently looking game. Very, very vibrant on the colors. Now, from my yes, knowledge, hold on, hold on. Really beautiful in a weird and kind of creepy way. To my knowledge, this demo is about half an hour long, but we're going to play it in its entirety no matter how long it is. Um, just kind of want to check out everything that's on offer here. So let's just kind of do that. Let's explore around, see what we have going on. Can we go through this? No. Nope can jump over that see that's up there like I need to find another way for now yeah I can't reach the ladder from here I'm too short I have that problem in real life as well too short man let's see so it looks like wherever these boards are we can make jumps right on over so we have that going on for us it looks like there is no actual jump button here we're just kind of jumping by moving towards these boards so keep that in mind when you're moving around well this button looks pretty punchy Boom. i'm using an xbox controller here as well you can use keyboard and mouse uh, but i'm using an xbox controller on my pc now, again, this game is available on Steam and will be out on July 12th, which is less than a month away Why now. There's so much tech in a forest. Looks like this is a pretty abandoned area here. This looks easy to break, but not with bare hands. Yeah. Let's go this way instead of going through the archway first. See a button here. 
is no forest. Storage for what? Why do I even ask? <laughs> What is this? Oh, it's a save point. Okay, cool. Well, we got our first save. Well, this makes me want to go back and check out the other thing. That's much better. It looks pretty when it's fixed. What does this pillar do exactly, chap? All right, we can push this box out of the way. Energy distributing it? What does this even mean? Gotta hold the A button to push this. There we go. So now we're going in here, but I want to go back and check the archway out now, because I thought the archway was the main path. Oh my Why god. At me? That's illegal, sir. I don't care who it thinks I am. Alright, so right bumper is dodge. You can see on the bottom that it, uh, the, the buttons here are actually not showing properly. I'm not sure if that's a uh, visual bug on my end, or if it's just, you know, the game isn't a demo right now, so maybe it's just not complete. Ow. Right, I've lost half of my health already, so I, you know, I'm very good at this game. I'm, I'm just absolutely the best. Yeah. We do have a stamina bar. Looks a lot like the stamina bar from Legend of Zelda. As you can see, the circle in the bottom middle of the page, or the window here. Let's go up here, press this button. Okay, that moves that over there so we can get across the other side now. Good news. Maybe we can find a weapon in here so we can defend ourselves. That'd be great. See that button over there, but let's see what's back here first. You know me, gotta explore. Gotta explore everything, man. Looks like all these boxes might be breakable after we get a weapon as well. See something floating there. Little drone guy or something. What is going on here? Key card. Common key card used for terminals around here opens one lower security opens one low security terminals near this area permanently. So it's a single use, but whatever it opens, it's permanent, so that's nice which we probably needed to grab this for this door over here because I think I saw this same symbol on it, actually. So we kind of just... kind of just made the right choice there without even realizing it. Yeah, that's the same thing. Perfect. Perfect. I do like the art style of this game so far, too. I, I, I like the way things are colored. Everything is clear, concise. You can see what everything is very well. Let's move this over here. Maybe we can jump on it. Very nice. We can save again. Looks like saving gives us health back, maybe? No, it does not. That's a lie. That's a lie. Ignore me. Okay, we have the door over there, but it's red, so I'm assuming we have to hit that button up top. So we need to figure out how to get up there, but this bridge, the catwalk, is broken. So let's go back here. Maybe this will move the, uh, the car here? Yes. Alright, so far so good. Figuring things out very rapidly. Not that it's overly complicated so far, <laughs> but you know. I'm proud of myself, okay? I'm not getting stuck yet. Press this button, drop on down, we're going. Now, I'm so curious about what that archway back there has. We might have to go back and check that out. Hey, what's that shiny thing? Ah. Let's check it out. That's our sword. Very nice. Let's go over there and try to get that now. Everything is broken down. It looks like it's uh, been abandoned for quite some time. Rather post-apocalyptic. So right? That's what I'm saying, dude. Yeah, 
And here we are. Look at this beaut. Yeah, man. Another man's trash? Is this gal's way to kick some ass? <laughs> Junk blade. A blade that lost its edge a long time ago. Swing it with something and target with your enemies with left trigger. Okay. Okay, so targeting is left trigger. And then our attack button is B. Noted. Nice. Now we can break those. Excellent news. Let's make another save here so we don't have to find another sword. I like it. Hmm. Nice, I rolled right behind him. A pile of scrap metal, not worth much, but still a good resource for spare parts. Alright. Alright, so now we can break those boxes. Hop on over here. Oh! See? I'm breaking things. Nutritious fruit that grows in the strange biotopes around here. Okay, that healed me. Excellent news. And what is this? Oh, more fruit. Okay. Couldn't see through the bridge of what that actually was. I Just saw the shining. No bad, feeling about this place. no bad feelings here. We've got a junk blade. Nothing can stop us now. All right. So the combat's not complicated so far, but, you know, this is just the very beginning of the game. It's just kind of taking us through uh, the ropes here, you know? Just kind of showing us what's what. So far, it's very generous with save points as well. Extremely generous. Okay, we need a key card for that. Hey, dude. Let's get out of the way there. So it looks like it's best to hit him twice, roll out of the way, hit him twice again. See that button up top there. What is this? Hmm. Oh. Well, um, that's a thing that happened. So I have to figure out something to do with that. I need to repair it or something. Let's go this way. See if these boxes have anything cool for us. Not sure what that was. Green circuit board. Circuit board that still contains precious materials that are still worth of worth to someone. Nice. Selling fodder. Alright, lots of guys back there. Let's go, uh. Oh, I can't go that way. That's blocked by that door. Nothing in here. How does one get over that? Oh, well, I mean, yeah, we got to just press this button. All right, open up that door back there. Don't think I can get in there that way, though. Yeah, I can't get in there that way. I still needed to come over here to press that button, so that's okay. So I guess we're going to go check out this side now. Oh, we got some sentry guns. Oh no, I've got one health left. Okay. So I did that for science. I wanted to see if I could like dodge through them, but it, appear, it appears not. There is no dodging through those. Let me go this way to make sure we can press that. Uh, yeah, we have to press this button again. Hey, give me that. Thanks. Wasn't sure if I'd be able to uh, just kind of dodge through all that and get through it, but I guess not. Now we know. You don't know until you try, okay? Now, is there any other way I can get in there? I don't really think so. Ha! 
Yeah, okay. So I still get a hit there. They take three quarters of a heart, or is that half a heart? Either way, we can't tank all that damage. There is a chest in there of some kind, though. We'll have to come back to that when we can figure out how to not take that damage. Maybe we'll find a shield here soon. All right, we don't even have to worry about uh, dodging. We just kind of spam attack there. I'm going to take one hit to kill, which is nice. We just got to hope that we can find a shield in here, maybe. All right, there's that. Hey, dude. Lots of heart berries, another green circuit board. Found a gear. Let's move this out of our way here. Nope. Oh, finding lots of these circuit boards. What is this? There goes our hope to find a human in this place. Tell me that's a shield. I hope it's okay if I borrow this from you for a bit. I don't this think you'll mind. Give us some protection against lasers and yes. other crap they throw at us. Very nice. All right, so right trigger to pull out the shield. Oh, hey. Medicinal purposes on the red herbs. Okay. Now let's go back to those uh, sentry guns and show them the new improved reed. You know? All right, I can't, can't do anything with this yet. This door is completely broken as well. I don't think we'll ever be able to use that door. That's just broken. I'm assuming we have to go take out those sentry guns and get to that chest. Maybe it'll have a key card to, you know, plug into that so it'll open up that other door that I just saw with the red arrows on it. All right, let's see what happens here. Wish me luck. Okay, it does take down stamina. So that's a thing. You gotta be uh, conscious of that. Oh. <laughs> nice. All right, what's in the box? Perfect. Exactly what I was hoping for. All right. We're moving along here. Hey, guys, do me a favor. If you have made it to this point in the video, leave a like on it. Hey, this is um, the first ever sponsored video that I've done here on YouTube, or at least since moving to YouTube from Twitch. So having your support on it would go a long way. It really, truly would. Thank you guys so much. And of course, thank you for just kind of checking this out. Again, do not do not forget to check out the Steam store page. Uh, the link is in the description down below. Just click on it. Check the game out. Download the demo yourself. It's completely free. You can do exactly what I'm doing now. If you want to get acquainted with the game, check it out. It does come out again July 12th, which is just less than a month away. Comes out very soon. So far, I'm having a good time with it. Uh, obviously, it's just kind of taking us through the basics of a game like this. As is expected, just kind of acquainting you with everything, giving you your first shield, your first sword. It's just kind of showing you how things in the game work overall. Ooh, whoa, they teleported me there. That hurt a lot. Okay. Well, let's break these boxes here. I kind of do want to go back and check out that archway, but I feel like I'm just kind of racking my brain about like a dead end. Nice. The good news is once those bad guys swing, they're kind of uh, just kind of stuck there for a moment, not doing anything.
All right. Just making sure to break all these boxes, see if we can find any other items, keep our uh, health up and all that. Ooh, shiny. Shiny. What's really cool is when you're locked on, the uh, the dodge works a little bit differently. You kind of hop around instead of doing the roll, which is cool. I like that. Makes more sense for the combat. Cables used to transfer electricity within robotic units. Hmm. Another safe spot here. Hey, here's this ladder from earlier. All right. Nice. And now there's a robot down here. Hey, I recognize this place. Yeah. Let's check out what's changed. Nice. Now this we couldn't get through earlier, so let's go check this out. Nothing special here. We can go up here now. All right, those are indestructible metal boxes. What is this? An audio log? Oh. I hope it gives us some clues about what happened here. Yeah. The sky fell. Literally, a co-worker of mine has been crushed by a faulty sky panel. A whole life snuffed out. Just like that. Oh. And it's not only the artificial sky that's falling apart. People get injured on a daily basis, and the living quarters for us workers pff, feels cheap and unsanitary. <laughs> the sky fell. Well, okay, he talks about the sky falling, and unfortunately it killed his friend. That's sad boy hours. That is sadness. Alright, uh, let's go this way. I think this will lead me to the archway. I think evil robotic laugh not sure how to feel about that one that was kind of oh that that's skynet status oh my god a little creepy all right let's go this way Ah. When did all these robots get here, man? That guy turned away at the worst possible moment for himself. Okay. Yuck. Yuck, 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 yuck. Why is this so warm? Oh, man. <laughs> it's warm water. I mean, the sun is shining, right? The sun is shining. I think that would geek me out a little bit too, though. All right. More robots. All right. More metal boxes we can't break. Here's the archway from earlier that it's been... It bothered me that I actually missed this. I thought it was the main path earlier. I think it still is the main path. Yeah. Okay, so this was blocking us anyway, so this is perfect. I actually didn't see that earlier, but I'm glad that we chose to go the other way first. Can I break these? No. I saw... Okay, can we talk about that? I saw a red barrel and instantly just went to swing at it to see if it would blow up. Like... <laughs> Luckily, it didn't. So that way I didn't take damage from it. Did you just tell his friend? Like, hey, there's a guy here. Get him. These robots are communicating amongst themselves now. Oh, I didn't even see you there. Okay, so when you're uh, locking onto a target, it does slow you down. But that kind of makes sense. That way you can kind of be more in tune to like the actual fight. So if you do want to move faster, you can just kind of do things without locking on. You can still, like, do your fighting thing, but right now I prefer to lock on. Whoop. I pressed the wrong button. Yep. 
You guys come over here. Nice. Perfect. Another save point here. We got 17 of these green circuit boards. I'm not sure if I think the green circuit boards themselves might be the currency that we end up using. I thought that they were selling fodder, but I think it's more like a barter. <laughs> All right, we're through here. More scrap everywhere. Rusted over at that. Let's hope this will finally get us out of this junkyard. Yeah. Oh. That is alive. Reed, that's alive. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Looks like the walkers from Legend of Zelda. Oh, it hurts. All right, how do I hurt you? Ah, this. Okay, nice. Can I block it? Okay, blocking it uh, took a lot of my stamina, I think. We'll, we'll try again on the next cycle here, if we could just straight up block it for science. I can't lock onto it, so that's a thing. What are you doing? Oh. Oh. It's in phase two. Just keep circling it, getting out of, getting out of the range of the blast there. All right. I want to see if I can block it. Let's see. Uh, we can, but it drains our stamina a lot. It drained my stamina so fast, it was basically not worth it. But okay, it's done. Not bad. Hey. Whoa. Keep it cool. I almost just got fried to a crisp by this gigantic and stupid overwatcher. Overseer, and you show up all cloaky dokey with this way too relaxed attitude. So no, mister. I will not keep it cool. <laughs> all right. I get it. I'm sorry. So you're not with them? Them? Dude, I don't even know where I am or who I am. Wait, you... You came down with that ship, right? More like I came crashing down in it, yeah. Are you, Xel? Follow me. All right. Okay, that looks like that might be the end of the demo. So short, sweet, about half an hour long, just as uh, just as it was said. So not bad at all. Not bad at all. I en I enjoyed what we played there. Uh, it looks like that was just like the very tutorial of the game before you really get kicked off into the actual story. Um, just all we know is that we are Reed. We don't know our name technically in the game via the story, but we are Reed. We crash down on a strange land and we have no memories of our former life. So we have to explore around, solve puzzles, get through dungeons and meet people and destroy enemies to figure out who we are and where we are. Now, I probably will check more of this game out when it does come out. I enjoyed that. It, it just it really does have Legend of Zelda vibes. Uh, that was great. I, I, I truly liked it. So we'll see what the game is like when it comes out. When we see full release, if I you know continue to enjoy it, then we'll continue to play it. Uh, based on what what happened here just in the first half hour it was it was nice uh, nothing is overly complicated the controls are you know simple everything seemed like it was lined up well the only thing that was problematic for me was just that the buttons weren't showing uh for the controls properly when it was telling me what to do so i had to figure it out by pressing buttons myself not a big deal 
uh, I'm sure that'll be fixed up on release, you know? But everything else, uh, I like the art style. I, I, I actually like the isometric, like, uh, 2.5 to 3D view of everything. Um, I enjoy the combat, and I'm sure it'll get, more, you know, more in tune. Just based on how that boss fight went, I'm sure it'll be more complicated as time goes on. We'll find more swords and stuff like that. More, not Maybe not swords, but just other weapons in general. Uh, not totally sure yet, but either way, I, I enjoyed the combat. Uh, again, the art style is nice. Everything ran very smoothly. And so overall, it was a good experience. It was a good experience. Thank you guys for sharing your time with me today. It means a heck of a lot. Thank you so much for supporting me in everything that I do. I wouldn't be here without you guys. Thank you so much for all of the love that you can show me on this video. And with that said, I'm out of here for now. I'll see you guys soon for more.